we're delighted to be hosting New York Digital Irish here at Havas Health and You, um, especially seeing as it's the first um, New York Digital Irish healthcare themed event, so it's very exciting. So Havas is made up of you know a number of different business organizations, including strategy, creative, um, market access. So all of these things come together, and of course, digital and innovation drive all of these things, especially in healthcare more and more. So we're eager to hear and learn from all of these startups and people in the room. I'm excited. We're about to get started tonight, and the format's a lot of fun. First, we'll introduce Digital Irish to those that may not be familiar. We'll take a second to introduce Havas Health and You, um, and we'll jump right into our panel. And that's where we can come in with our experts, hear their point of view, their experience and their story. First is Dr. Heimberger. Karn is the CEO of a company called Lifebulb, and their business is really about representing the empowered patient's voice in healthcare, and they create forums for organizations to engage more with empowered patients. And when we that's one of the things we're going to learn about it. Well, what is an empowered patient? And today there's so many opportunities for an individual to have a direct role in their health care. So she'll talk about both being an empowered patient, but also she started several businesses and is invested, so she can also share the investor's perspective. In addition to that, Mickey Nash is the VP at Evidation Health, which is a fascinating new startup backed by Stanford and the GE Innovation Fund. I would call us the connective tissue piece. So we're a data science company. What we did is we collected all of the consumer data generated in the health context. So pedometers, weight scales, anything and everything that is connected because this, this data that we are generating here in this, in this digital realm is incredibly valuable in describing some character and what your outcomes are going to be over time. So that's our core uh, body of work right now. So I think what's most exciting to hear the startups in the room, um, hearing about new innovative ways to solve medical problems. Um, the traditional model of healthcare is vastly disappearing and we're looking to um, data and technology to solve some of the chronic problems in terms of illnesses that have existed for a long time. I was actually very happy to be invited to this uh, for a couple of reasons. What I'd look, to look forward to get out of this meeting is meeting some people that potentially could be partners with us. We are planning to expand, um, so anybody who's got the right background, um, you know, it would also be appropriate to talk to them as well. I've traditionally done business with Havas, so I'm very familiar with them. So in terms of the, the people who are not Havas people, but are just, you know, potentially resources within the area, uh, it's, I think this is a great an opportunity, great venue to kind of meet those people and sort of see what their background is and, and how it might apply to what we do. We've built a digital platform that's able to turn the referral process into an on-demand space where doctors are actually competing for patients, uh, compete for patients' uh, time, and uh, so we've, we've changed the paradigm completely and it's, uh, it's, uh, it's having a huge effect in healthcare right now. The hardest thing in the world to do is actually get some, some form of exposure. When you're new and you're in the healthcare space, everybody's waiting on you to have done something before they actually want to take you in and even listen to you. Uh, situations and, and nights like, like tonight, um, this gives us an after, a chance to actually talk to people that might have some influence and network and, uh, and just get us on that next rung of the ladder just to, just, to, just to have somebody listen to our story, check our product and, uh, and give us a chance basically. No matter who you are and um, what you do, whether you're someone who's had a stroke, whether you've had a hip replacement, whether you're a football player, there's always an exercise program that you can do to help yourself. Um, and it's relevant to patients, it's also relevant in the um, employee wellness and corporate um, sort of occupational health market, which is very relevant over here with workings compensation and so on. Our platform it tells you what to do or helps engage you with the exercise program and um, supports you in engaging regularly with it prescribed exercise programs. So it's, it's great to get the opportunity to meet other people um, based here in New York and sort of find out about the digital scene here in New York and I guess get a bit of support as well. You know? So it's not just meeting people for the first time but it's learning those common areas of interest and passion and it's also just seeing what other people are doing which is, which is really exciting. Nights like this as I say we, we need more of them.